There she go. There she go. Happy birthday. Oh my god. Oh, look at the big jingle. This is so cute. Did a lot of shit just to live this here lifestyle. I look like a Barbie doll. Hey, 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 hey. I'm at the building. Everybody It's strong. Go red, Go red, Go Kind of vibe you never let go. She know what to do to make a man go up and down, up and down, up and down. Girl, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So we're about to be getting ready for Zay's birthday trip slash valentine's first up is nails i just wanted to switch it up and walk out through my appointments and show y'all how time consuming it could be how it's expensive to be a damn bad but we gotta do what we gotta do i love being a girl at the end of the day my nail appointment was at nine in the morning she's a new nail tech this is my third time going to her so far so good so as y'all see her nail room is so freaking cute customer service 10 out of 10 you can get free drinks free snacks real drinks at that so i got a matcha but let's get into the nails so i started off with a soak off extra extra long tips please so this time i was going with a valentine set i usually don't go with like whatever the holiday is but i was in the valentine spirit so so I do get a little bit cut off, but not too much. As y'all see, just a little bit. My favorite part is the acrylic. I just love the smell of getting my nails done. I would say I hate how long they take, but not really because I'm just so used to it. I've been getting my long nails for so many years. My nails take four hours plus. You know a nail tech is good when the shape look like this and they haven't even drilled it, filed it, nothing, baby. And the shape is already given. That's my main thing I look for in a nail tech is the shape. I like watching some type of show, some type of movie when I'm getting my nails done. It just makes the time go by quicker or music either or it's fine with me i feel like we don't talk enough about how getting your nails done really hurt i hate the drilling the filing the buffing all of that nails be sore the next day but like i said beauty is pain so i'm gonna thug it out every time look at the shape just look at the shape the design is when all the fun starts so like i told y'all i went with a valentine set bows i just love when they start bringing the colors out the charms all of that how long y'all think these nails took before i tell you y'all drum five hours y'all i'm not a morning person but for my nails i'm always be a morning person i always book the earliest that they got so these is probably one of my favorite sets y'all they're just so pretty the bows i know y'all been seeing the bows trending a lot recently but a lot of people been doing the pink bows the white bows and i had to give it to them red bows so this design turned out really really pretty it was real detailed the last final touches is just to add hearts to them i feel like they just kept getting prettier and prettier can't forget the top coat my favorite going from the matte look to the glossy look it definitely adds that final touch and one more thing you cannot forget the oil on the cuticles your nails that went through all that stuff they just be ashy so this just brings it back to life for your pictures and videos and the claws is done so obsessed with my claws so beautiful the red the hearts the lace the bows this set is a 10 out of 10 big shout out to my nail tech she made my inspo come to life so claws check on to our next stop so next stop is eyebrows i've been going to bobby for years on top of years since i was like in high school and nobody has touched my eyebrows since probably like summertime i'll do like arm wax leg wax but for the winter i don't really do all that so this pretty much has been her same shop since we've been going to her just you know probably a few upgrades every now and then this is my before my eyebrows look crazy i haven't got my eyebrows done in a minute so they was looking crazy and i needed it real bad so threading to me is real painful she'd be like that it gets better over time but baby i've been going for years and it ain't got no better over time so just be prepared for the pain sometimes can be less painful than other times like sometimes my eyes won't tear up some other times i'm down bawling so it just really depends the bottom part hurts the worst the top part ain't as bad she usually has you hold it but since i have long nails she just gave up i can't hold it with my long nails but if you don't have nails she'll have you hold it for her and it makes it easier when I first started getting my eyebrows done, I used to do wax. 
so i feel like threading is better wax is like a little less painful but threading is just overall better it lasts longer and the results is just better overall so y'all know yager is a damn hairy monster <laughs> I hate being down hairy. So I also get my upper lip done. Oh my damn God, y'all. Painful, painful, painful. Threading this right here is really the definition of beauty. It's pain, but I thug it out each time because I don't want them have a mustache out here. So to end it, she just wipes it with alcohol and then you're good to go. Eyebrows is back on fleek. And like I said, it lasts longer. So I won't see Bobby till like another month or so. Bye. So next stop is pedicure. I just had to go home and do a quick little freshen up, check on my baby, change my fit, and make myself look a little decent, but I still look crazy. I've been to this nail shop once before, and I remember the last time I went, they wasn't as busy compared to the one I usually go to. So I'm like, let me pull up on them. But y'all, they was busy as well. But what I like is that they have this whole bar so you can actually sit while you're getting your toes done. The aesthetics in here is so cute. It's like nude with pops of gold, black. Really, really cute. So I went with the jelly pedicure with the lavender scent. It just feels real good and smells good. So y'all know I haven't been drinking for a whole month. So I did decide to get me some wine feel good while i'm getting my toes done and preparing myself because we about to go on vacation i ain't done no drinking and i'ma just say after my damn pedicure appointment i was feeling a little buzz y'all actually hate getting my toes done like i just feel like it hurts or maybe i'm too ticklish i hate when they do the scrubbing all of that but i know they're trying to get the dead skin off or the damn towels be too damn hot the rocks be too hot i just hate it to be honest i feel like my feet is real sensitive so i just always feel uncomfortable i wish they could just do the paint job and let's go but i know all the other stuff is needed so i just be like whatever so i went with a french tip and i really wanted hearts on it because i wanted it to match my nails so i'm like let me get some little hearts i don't think that's so you know complicated y'all when i tell y'all this lady right here down try to do this heart a thousand times like a thousand times and she just couldn't get it i'm thinking the design is so simple so i ain't think nothing of it but listen to what she just said right here she knew she messed up because she laughed before me but but just listen to this y'all <laughs> No. What kind of hard is that? <laughs> so after that, y'all, she tried a few more times. So then I just told her it was okay. Like, you know, I wasn't mad at it, but I think she felt bad. She was really sweet. I wasn't mad. I told her it was okay, but she then went and got somebody else to do it. So then that person tried a few times. And then she was like, my husband draws really good heart. All of them couldn't do a damn heart, but... I kept telling her it was okay, but she just kept pulling people from the damn back. I done had like four people on my damn toes. Couldn't nobody do the damn heart. I guess after a minute, she just gave up. She was really sweet, so I'm not mad at it. My toes still ended up looking cute with just the French tip, you know, clean. I don't really like my toes, so y'all better not be looking at them too hard, but pedicure is done. So the next day is hair appointment day. Thank you to Addie Pearl for providing this wig. It's a blonde highlight wig, 22 inches. I always like to check the hair out before I drop it off to the hairstylist. It was so soft, the lace was pre-plucked, and it came with a whole bunch of goodies like the melt band, wig cap, lashes. We love that. So this is the actual day of my hair appointment. Just showing y'all my little fit check and how my hair looked before. I won't get cute for none of my other appointments, but for my hair appointment, baby. I'm gonna throw a cute little set on every time. So we pull up to the studio and I'm ready to just transform. I'll be tired of my natural hair. I always gotta bring me a water just in case. My braid downs usually take 45 to an hour. This was actually a new braider. She'll usually braid it or she'll have like a braid there, but they wasn't too tight. They felt good. So my hairstylist is snatched by Simone. I've been going to her for like almost five years now. So she always gets me right. The color on the wig is beautiful. They color did well the highlights were just so pretty this was my first time getting a blonde highlight wig so i was excited this is the part where you find out if the color is gonna look good on you when they put the wig on for the first time i'll be nervous but i honestly feel like blonde is my color so i wasn't too worried the lace just melted into my skin so nice it just looks so natural it just blended so well this is probably like my fourth time getting a blonde wig like i said i feel like it's my color let me know what y'all think i just feel like blonde on me just does it every single time so the wig did already come straight which i know she gonna make it even more straight bone straight as she's flat ironing y'all see how soft it just looks bouncy full now it's time to do the edges i love when we get to the edges because that means we're close to done 
I need to buy me one of these mini flat irons because I be trying to down re flat iron my edges with the big one and be down about burn my face. She gonna slay the edges every single time. I literally get the same edges every time, just two on the side and then two by the ears. I know some people like the one in the middle, but I personally just get the same style every time. And we're all done, y'all. This wig is so pretty. I just felt like a Barbie. The highlights were so pretty. I just keep mentioning the highlights because why well, didn't no blonde highlights? lights existed so I'm so obsessed that wasn't enough I had to keep showing y'all once I got home how pretty the hair was felt so soft after you get your hair done baby can't nobody tell you nothing like the feeling after your hair appointment you just start feeling yourself the wig was good quality I had to just turn up for the wig because that's how damn good i was feeling y'all will see how the wig holds up throughout the rest of my vlog but let me just say very little shedding i'm so in love with this wig definitely be expecting to see it many more times big shout outs to ali pearl for this beautiful wig if y'all are interested in this wig i will have all the information in my description box but hair done feeling like that girl and looking like that girl period so after my hair appointment, I had to get my Valentine's outfit tailored. I purposely ordered a bigger size because they didn't sell the set separate. So I'm like, I'd rather the top part be bigger and then I just get the bottom part tailored. So this spot is in our mall and they're just so quick with it. They'll have it ready whenever you want it. Just make, you gotta make sure you pay them coins. You need it same day, they have day price and then you need it the next day. So I just went with next day because you know we still have one more day left. Y'all see that big difference? She had to snatch it up because the skirt was just giving two loops. So that was just a one, two, three and we done. All right, y'all, next day, day three of doing all my maintenance stuff is like, uh, are we ever gonna be done? But we almost there. Guess what I'm getting, y'all? Lashes. Y'all know I don't never really do lashes, but people always be like, no, no, you take forever, you take forever to get ready. So lashes on vacation is the best thing for me. So I'm like, why not? Saves me a little time. So I'm actually pulling up on my girl Charisma. She was the one that used to do my nails, but her real passion is lashes. So she just stopped doing nails and she just, you know, focusing on lashes. So yeah, know I had to pull up on her and let her get me right. So she actually has a new shop and baby. Giving is giving. This is nice, girl. This audit is you right here? Okay. It don't smell like roaches in here or nothing. Look at my sis tell me on the wall, okay, tell me. I just love when your workspace looks like you put thought into it, effort into it. I love it. So here go my girl Charisma. She about to get me right. It was kind of hard trying to record with my eyes closed. So I did get a few little clips of the process. But I don't have nothing against lashes. I just feel like whenever it's time to do my skincare routine, I can't really get into it because you can't really get your lashes with. So that's really why I don't really like them. I feel like they're real high maintenance and you really got to take care of them for them to last. So I always go for like natural and real full. I don't really like like the real long or real extra so i just always say natural and real full so that's the look we went for i was so obsessed with these lashes i don't know they were just a little different from all my other times i could probably count on my hand how many damn times i got my lashes done but i definitely want to get more into it because i just felt like that girl once she was done and i felt like that girl on my whole damn trip lashes just give pretty with no effort so big big shout outs to my girl charisma make sure y'all check her out so obsessed with my lashes and now y'all girl is finally all ready for her vacation all that's left is packing so lashes so obsessed all right y'all now that everything is done it's time to pack because we got a flight to catch period a a a a a a a lit yes i'm one of them people that don't unpack until it's time to pack for my next trip sorry i don't know what to tell y'all <laughs> so i had most of my fits planned out so it made packing so much easier so this is just me laying out what outfits we was taking on the trip i just wanted to show y'all all the details the accessories the shoes that was going with the fits but y'all why the worst thing happened while i was packing i got sick i'm over here trying to be all organized for y'all show y'all my fits y'all i just started feeling really really bad out of nowhere like diarrhea throwing up feeling really lightheaded really really bad to the point i wasn't able to finish packing i just started throwing everything in there i didn't know what was wrong with me but i just knew i needed to lay down so that's why the packing was cut short because y'all i literally felt like i was damn dying but your girl is currently going through it and we had a damn flight to catch the next morning but all i could do for that night was just try to relax and see if i felt better the next morning 
all right y'all next morning which is flight day and i woke up feeling even worse but i had to push through because we already had flight booked hotel booked i already had something planned for zay birthday he already had something planned for valentine's but deep down inside i was like really dying and i just knew something wasn't right because i'm like the people that don't ever get sick like i might get sick once a year and i thank god for that didn't even have it in me to like do anything i was looking like how i felt i didn't want to be a party pooper at the end of the day it was a birthday so i'm telling him you know you keep the good vibes going because usually when it's a trip baby we turning up on the plane as soon as we land all of that so zay did get him a little shot on the plane and you know was still keeping his spirits up and trying to make me feel better all i was doing was just drinking a whole bunch of liquids we landed safely once i land i'm gonna finally finally talk to y'all and let y'all know what was going on but thank god we landed to our destination safely and voiceover nana is out let me know if y'all enjoyed the voiceovers of me getting ready i feel like it was just like right to it and you know just my little comments on certain stuff so like i said voiceover nana is out let's go to real life nana bye hey y'all welcome back to my channel y'all girls been going through it but basically this is the first time y'all are hearing from me it was supposed to be basically in the beginning just me getting ready doing all my maintenance stuff but when i was packing I just got this weird feeling like started feeling sick out of nowhere first it was just like i don't know it's too much information diarrhea back to back so the last thing i had ate was a damn papa wings from zay had got some and i had just stole like one little wing so i'm thinking nothing of it like oh it just messed my stomach up but as i'm still trying to pack i started feeling lightheaded dizzy weak feeling like i had to throw up so i couldn't continue i had to go downstairs and lay down and just call it a night around four in the morning i just woke up threw up barely made it to the toilet so i looked up all my symptoms and i personally believe i got food poisoning from the damn papa wings so we are currently on vacation and when i woke up today still feeling not so good from y'all getting ready with me y'all kind of know a little idea what's going on it's Zay birthday and valentine's he pretty much said for his birthday this year he wanted to go somewhere with nice weather his options was orlando miami and I'm like, I want to do something different. I wanted to go to Chicago, but y'all know Chicago is real cold. Y'all know I'm still waiting on my passport, so we don't have many options. So he ended up deciding with Miami. Y'all know I love Miami. So we have currently made it to our hotel. And as y'all see, I'm in bed, not feeling the best. Kind of sucks. I'm feeling like this on our first freaking day. Like, what? Zay said he just wanted to watch the Super Bowl today. Before I even got sick, he just wanted to go somewhere and watch it. But I'm not feeling the best. Hopefully, tomorrow I wake up feeling brand new and just back to myself. I'm ready to have fun. So a few things on the agenda tomorrow for his actual birthday. We have a yacht booked. Since he said he wanted to go somewhere with nice weather, I thought, why not? Let's get on the yacht. I've always actually been scared to get on one because I don't like water at all. But it's his birthday, so I'm doing it for him and I'm also doing it for myself. And then for Valentine's, he said he got something planned for the 13th and the 14th. Something about they booked it wrong, so he got something planned for both days. So Valentine's usually is a surprise, so I don't know what he has up his sleeve. And Valentine's is all about me if you're new here. And then Sweetest Day is all about him, so yep. Probably talking y'all head off, but I haven't talked to y'all, so I just needed to update y'all. Currently just trying to shake back. Y'all about to see our room tour. So freaking cute. I'm so obsessed with this room. I love y'all. appreciate y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Show Zay some birthday love in the comments. And we is in Miami, our favorite spot. I know I sound dead, but I'm still. What runs with dead feelings? I'm still lit. They trying to take me out, but they can't take me out. Well, I've been beating it up, trying to get this out of my body. But as of right now, we chilling. Y'all about to see the room tour, so let's get into it. But we is in Miami. I'm going to enjoy the luxury of life. Not knowing each other for real. Flower bomb, let me get your favorite fragrance. And you got that bomb. I'm trying that nature. No disrespecting, baby. Just trying to make you smile. 
Try to keep my spirits up. That's why I lay down. Try to keep your spirits up. Little vodka, whatever. Took it forever to get dressed. I acknowledge your effort. So I clap for her. She deserves an applause. Shawty working so hard. She deserves that baton. Shawty wear your baton. Racing through my mind like she heard that. I got that work. I heard that she been on strike. Can't tell. I need your mind. She been on them dollars first. Caramel. Hockey out. I'm with Shawty getting the work. I can be your boyfriend. Be your vegan. Or a grand with perk. I'm just trying to work that. They just trying to work your nerves. I'm just trying to read your mind. I'm just trying to feed you mine. I'm just trying to keep you light. They just trying to Just basically forced myself to get up and get ready because they have a rooftop bar. So I'm like, we might as well go up there to bring in Zay's birthday at 12. But while I was asleep, he actually, he went to watch the Super Bowl at one of the bars in the hotel and had him some drinks and stuff. So 10 p.m. I'm feeling back regular for the moment. So hopefully that stuff is fully gone because it's basically been 24 hours that I've been going through it because this was like around the same time I was like packing last night and I started feeling sick. So I'm hoping it's gone. Got dressed. I just threw on a little chill sweatsuit. It's like a little crop sweater. It's a skirt with like a little extra layer. Got my wrist on. Chilling. Yeah, we're about to go to this little rooftop bar to bring in Zay's birthday. But yep, just wanted to check out with y'all and hopefully it's time to, you know, get the vibes going so i will see y'all once we head up there Ha, sicker than your average Pop a twist, cabbage off instinct Niggas don't think shit stink Pink gators, my Detroit players Tim's for my hooligans in Brooklyn Dead right, get the head right Biggie there, air night Papa been small since days of under rules Never lose, never choose to Bruce Cruz who, do something to us Talk go through us Girls walk to us Wanna do us, screw us, who us? Yeah, Papa and Pop <laughs> Close like Sparsky and Hutch, stick to the clutch Hit yeah, I squeeze three at your cherry M3 Bang every MC easily Please hear me recently Niggas frontin' ain't sayin' nothing So I just speak my peace Keep my peace Cubans with the Jesus peace With my peeps packin' Askin' who want it You got it 
Saints and 49ers. They knocked out the playoffs, you know what I'm saying? Not the conference with it right now. But that beat us, you know what I'm saying? This was the worst Super Bowl I ever experienced in life. They only kicked field goals and scored two touchdowns. So I don't approve, but we got the dub. It's real windy. My hair probably messed up. Catch up to Zay, so I'm on my second round. Don't you already got a buzz? Yeah, I he had. I thought I was recording, but like I should have recorded. I, my phone don't work. Though. You had what? Two, three I mojitos? Yeah. Y'all know I haven't drank in a month, so I don't know if I'm gonna get drunk easily on this trip. They gonna kick us out. Countdown. It's your birthday. Cheers. Happy birthday. Forty-five. We're back. We're on our floor, and this guy thinks he can beat me in a race. We got an eventful day tomorrow, so we ain't, we wasn't trying to be up there all the way, you know, to the closing time. Me and Zay about the race. <laughs> Cause he think he could beat me. How are we going back? All right, y'all vote who won. You go right here. You didn't even oh, race. It's not running. <laughs> You didn't even race. <laughs> I would give you a head start. Let's do it again. Bruh. I would give you a head start because I cheated. Because I work out there. Yeah, I'm going to retire. I am Mark. You say go. <laughs> who won? They going to tell us who won. I feel like you wasn't racing for real. I done dislocated my arm. What is it called? Ankle, ankle. But it's officially Isaiah's birthday. How you feel to be turning 26? Yeah, I've been with. This is my sixth birthday. You about to call me six? This is my sixth. Sixth. <coughs> birthday with six. With, with Zay. They don't know you at six. That's what my mom called him. You're actually Isaiah. This is the sixth birthday with Zay. But y'all know the first time we ever met was. On my birthday. On his birthday. In Miami, first time we ever met. So this is technically our anniversary, but when I asked her out, it was in April. So I guess that's not it's our like anniversary. A full circle. Yeah, the this is our full circle anniversary. First time we ever met on his birthday in Miami. In Miami. That's crazy. Yeah, but we'll play some music, cause right. y'all, I know y'all heard that music out there. Pump it up, bro. Bro, come <laughs> on, bro. That was a, the drinks was good. They were strong, but the music, I can't get jiggy with that. Yeah, that's what I want to do right now. Bro, the songs they just played. Yeah, what do you I'm know doing. about this? <laughs> yeah, what do you think right here? Zay, how do you know this song? <laughs> this your song? What do you know about this? Cause I'm confused how you know. Para lo que dijeron que no lo iba a lograr. Look at this view. So beautiful. Dijeron que no la iba a lograr. Y ahorita todos están callados. The vibes. We on the balcony with it. Hey, 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 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, 26, Rest in peace, rest in peace to the parking lot. Phantom so big, can't even fit in the parking spot. Y'all thought I was finished? When I bought that Eskimo, y'all thought it was rented? Yeah!
so long as a billboard that does it, it ain't a hate train if you conduct it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we're coming inside because it's probably loud out there, windy. Thirty floors up. Thirty floors up. Oh my niggas. Yeah. No bars. Definitely short. <laughs> oh, we gotta go back. fix my hair i threw makeup on today just something natural but today it's gonna be in the 80s so i'm nervous because i've actually never worn a wig to miami i just always felt like it was too hot but when i checked the weather it said like 75 to 80 so i'm thinking like that ain't too bad compared to how it usually be so i'm just hoping and praying the wig don't sweat off on this damn trip because the yacht isn't into three to five where we're gonna be like you know just sitting in it but I don't know y'all if this wig sweat off i don't know how to damn glue it back on let's hope it don't though but of course we're gonna get brunch first just to kill time before it's time to go on the yacht i want to get me some mimosa or something like that so i'm about to show y'all my yacht fit we're doing burberry swim i've actually had this bathing suit for probably three years and i just never wore it so i'm like let me finally wear it so it's that the little burberry top had to get the Burberry purse with it, had to. And just to cover it up, you know, while we on the way there and for brunch, I got this cover up, but I got some shades. Y'all pretty much seen it when I was packing. And of course, red Gucci, just to bring out the red in it. But I'm about to get dressed, then put it on, and then I'm gonna come show y'all. Y'all know YouTube be playing with me, so. I'm gonna try my best to show y'all how it looks on. All right, y'all, so the bathing suit is on. I lost 10 pounds, but I feel like I still got more work to do. I like the weight gain a little bit, but I just want my stomach back flat, so. I feel cute, but I'm still like, what is it called? Self-conscious, I think. Self-conscious. Yeah, we got a little work to do, but still look good. Um, so I just wanted to show y'all before I put the cover up on what it's giving. <sighs> And I can't show too much, but it's giving Barbie doll with the blonde too. Sound like, you know what I'm saying? I do the all uh, black. You got the, uh, what's it called? Psycho, Psycho Bunny. Bunny. I always ride, I'm not ride past. I always see this store when I be going to different malls, but I never knew like what they sold or nothing like that. So this, like, today I decided to go in there and they said it's like a popular like Hispanic brand or Latino brand. Yeah, like the. People we listen to, the Hispanic um, artists we listen to wear that. That's how I heard of the brand. I'm like, let me just go ahead and grab some little cool, little simple little fit from out of there. So, yeah, you know what I'm saying? A little, little bucket hat with the shorts to match, black tee. Ready for this yacht, man. All right, y'all. So full bodies because our suitcases. But yeah, you like this cover up? Claudia didn't really care too much for it. I don't know. Yeah, I like it. Look like, but I don't know. I kind of feel like it covers up the hook. Well, that's what it is, but I think she probably wanted me to like one that shows more, but yeah, it's going to do the job. So y'all see the little heels, bring out the red, and then these is the shades that I'll probably, you know, put on the yacht, not right now. Y'all girl is ready for the yacht. Well, first we're going to get brunch. My mother's So birthday boy is actually waiting on his phone. Well, his camera don't work, so he took it to the Apple store at what, 10 in the morning? Yeah, so it's just great. So are we gonna get your phone or are we going to? Going to All right, y'all, so I'll see y'all once we get to brunch. I'm not, well, what spot did you decide with? Uh, cafe something. Yeah, cafe Americana. All right, see y'all there. Easy no, you don't need figure down. Easy no, no need figure down. Bitch, I'm stylish. Glock talk, big t-shirt, Billy. Got on my wrist, but I want that diamond. Niggas talk crazy when I pull up in sight. Mile high, bring that shit back, bitch. I'm stylish. Got to talk big t shirt, Billy. Ice. 
Got on my wrist, but I want that dime. Things talk crazy when I pull up in sight. Hey, my heart hey, broke up first class on the pipe. Put it in perspective. Uh, Bitch, I got everything I wanted and some extra. I am not the type of turning into a detective. Uh, got two on my own phone, barely even check them. Uber used to food, I don't call, I just text them. Uh, Cash out on Bell, my little bitch got a best. Uh, Flexed out my Lexus, no backseat, so no best. Uh, Protected, no gaster, so don't text. Hey, two pistols, 30s in the clip, these are Kimbo's. Open hands, smack him in his mid bitch, I'm Kimbo. You be throwing cash on the strip, my little bitch, sucking big for the free. I got a bitch, but a bitch ain't got me. I know she trip when I dip, so I agree. They bitch and pillow talking about me like a mama mouse. It needs to be laid down like around. Hey, Shabamoto. I ordered taco birria. That's not even breakfast. Damn. When you said it, you caught me up. God, I'm like, damn. Because they had their lunch menu available. So I got birrias. They got um, chicken and waffles. All right, y'all got the birria tacos. They look a little light skin. Try and more toast tastes like a quesadilla. I don't know if that makes sense. Like the meat don't got no flavor. I like how it came with a side of corn. I love corn. I hope it's ready in 15 minutes. That place is to be. We on the way to the yacht. Ah uh, yes, did you get it? Okay, thank you. Well, you've actually been on one before, right? But he said for work, so he didn't get to really enjoy it. Yeah, I was filming. Yeah, it was down here too. I've never been on one. I used to always say I don't want to get on one. Oh, we got our. We picked up our necklace the with the coke. So. But I still don't have a phone. So. Oh yeah, Apple all day kept saying one then they said two then they said three so he ain't got a phone i'm ready to see because i went with the option where it'd be decorated outside and inside and his favorite color so i'm ready to see the decor so yep once we pull up yeah we'll see we made it oh my god i'm nervous now oh wow I'm nervous now, Zay. Because we're here. Because we're here. Look at the water. <laughs> well, maybe the Hennessy will make it better. Catch the butt. Remember, I'll find a me one. Uh, oh. <laughs> it's dark. All right. I didn't even get us getting on, but we walking in. Oh, this is where the 26 at. Yeah, that's what she said. She said she tried to put it up top, but it kept flying, so. 26. It's a hard 26 right here. Oh my God, we about to get started. They got a little big. They got two bigs. They got one down here too. But it's all to ourselves, just me and him. They got a bathroom, they got shower. Look. Well, oh, they got two? Well, yeah. it do be for like multiple people. They got like a little bathroom, little yacht tour, little yacht tour. <laughs> well, I ain't show y'all the outside because when we was getting on, I was a little nervous. You got another bathroom? Yeah, like a shower. That's hard though. Little yacht tour. Let me take a picture right here. Well, let's go back outside so I can show them. Oh my God, we about to start. This the decor out here. Ah! We lit. Okay, there go better luck. Y'all know his favorite color. Big black. Big 26. You feel me? That's how you do it right here. <laughs> you feel better now? You not nervous? Well, we ain't really got started yet, but it feel, feel pretty good. Cheers. Cheers. Look at her being a big girl. Look at her being a big girl. 
being a big girl. <laughs> Look at her being a big girl. Look at you. This Look is at you being a big girl. This feel good though. I told you. But I, I, I wonder how people take the little picture hanging off the little thing. That's a vibe right here. It feel good. Like it's not too hot. It's like the perfect weather. My hat flew off in the water. My <laughs> hat flew off. And my hair is flying like. Uh, whatever. So we got the hair to see. I'm gonna ask the lady. I got my phone. This is our third shot in. We're trying to go as fast as we can. I swear. I'm fucking up this way. Don't speak Portuguese. I can't speak English. Y'all, so Zay is having a blast. And we only been out here for like 30 minutes. So this served to add it two more hours. I don't know how I was gonna be on there. I don't know if I was gonna feel sick or whatever. So I'm like, let's just start off with two hours. But he wanna add two hours. It's his birthday, so whatever, you know, it's his day. Let's speak English. Three to seven. Three to seven. So we added two hours. I'm about to cry. <laughs> Just like a full circle moment. We back in Miami. We ain't no jet skis this time. We on the mother yeah. It's just like wow, like life is really beautiful. Bruh, it's so much that we can do in life, bruh. And this I just guy. be so scared. It's like scared of what? Like this is beautiful. This is life. Like this is what you need to be seeing. We don't work hard and make you know saying the money we make for no reason. We to say, this is what it's worth right here. Wow, look at this. That's <laughs> Xfinity. Arriba Sixto. This is my song though. What do you say? Y ahorita todo están callado. I want to rather spend my birthday no other way than like this. It's probably smart to other people, but big, I ain't never thought I'd be on a damn yacht coming from where I come from. This it though, right here, man. We appreciate all y'all for supporting us. Yeah. Uh, Cash Doll huh. Detroit. Huh. Stand yeah. Up yeah. Detroit. Huh. Detroit. Yeah. Detroit. Yeah. In a building. Alright, let's freestyle. Let's freestyle. <laughs> My name is Nana. And I'm in Miami. <laughs> and what? <laughs> now I'm drinking Hennessy. And I'm on a yacht. They thought it wasn't possible. <laughs> I'm fucking rapping too. Alright, right, look. We at the Port of Miami. <laughs> <laughs> I can't rap, bro. That's why I never rap. rap. 26. We on the yacht. What you say? Showing the tits. Oh, somebody pledged that. Yeah, they show, they show the tits. I don't know what's after that. Ah, you popping that. Let me. We never met. Burberry. Psycho bunny. <laughs> Bro, I wish I could freestyle. That's why she's a vlogger and I'm a uh, right. videographer, so. I wish I knew how to damn rap. Yeah, y'all seen that freestyle suck. Why ain't made it? Why the night got with? Why I'm still stuck in this hell? Why the guy not help? Ah, 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 just to live this here lifestyle From the bottom to the top my lifestyle uh, There she go There she go There she go hey, From the bottom to the top my lifestyle I think fine They wanna know how I got used and I ain't finished college Just to live this here lifestyle From the bottom to the top my lifestyle I can ask you before I get a pick with God. Yeah. Let's Hey, tell him. And we been had swipe before the money. 
Diddy house right there. That P Diddy house. Now what's funny is that a literally be P Diddy house. We don't nah, know. it's not P Diddy. It's Diddy P. I think Diddy really said like that Diddy house right there. Bro, that's it. That's what I thought. Rick Ross brought that house. That's what I thought. Rick Ross. Big guns in the last time. Say you look like me, quit lie. Everybody, everybody. Shout out Uncle David. And shout out my grandma. I know y'all looking down at us. Oh, my phone went dead. My phone went dead. I don't have a Y'all know Zay didn't have a phone. Hey, Loki, it feels good not having a phone because I'm just enjoying the moment for what it is. You know what I'm saying? 26, out here in Miami with the woman I love. I'm glad I got to experience this with Isaiah. Kiss. <laughs> Nah, nah, sleep. Camera about to die. But we out here. I love y'all, man. I appreciate y'all for the support, man. Day 26th birthday. We going out. I basically went outside for the whole night, y'all. Like, we got back. Once I got up, it was like already too late to go out. We were supposed to do dinner, then probably try to go to like a lounge or something for his birthday. I mean, Zay, you ain't black out. What happened? Like, <laughs> you fell asleep. This picture right here. Oh my God, he wanna. Yeah, cause you you just swear, just swear, just look, look at her. Only at sleep. So, you went to sleep. 
I went back up to the, uh, I stayed with you for a little bit, and then I went back up to the top and was talking to the dude or whatever, and then I went on the front of the boat and was just chilling for a little bit. But then once we was getting closer, I came down there to wake you up. Like, come on, it's time to, you know what I'm saying, get up. You're talking about, mm -mm -mm, I'm staying right here. Like, you can't stay right here. <laughs> so that was that. Our phones was dead. The people had to call us to Uber. Well, I didn't have a phone. Her phone was dead. People had to call us to Uber. Got in the Uber. Came here. Well, you stumbled all the way over to the Uber. Came back here and went to go get my phone. Get the Apple, bro. It still wasn't ready. They couldn't activate my cellular data. So I had to go to T-Mobile to get my to phone cut off. It was like down the street. It's all oh. in the same life vicinity. So I have to mind you, I'm damn near drunk. <laughs> so I'm doing all this drunk. Get my phone, walk over to T-Mobile, have them do that. Then I came back up here and you was in the bed. Then after about 11 o'clock, I'm like, all right, yeah, she ain't gonna get up, so I just went to sleep myself. I just can't believe it, yo. Yeah, the yacht basically beat me, and I woke up thinking I missed Thursday birthday, but I woke up feeling dizzy, and then I remember you saying, this the best birthday. Oh, just, I think you said this the best birthday ever or something, so I guess I ain't mess up the night. Nah, it ain't ruining the night. That was something that is like, we both enjoyed being on that yacht yesterday. Like, you know what I'm saying? We had our little moment, we were looking up at the clouds. You know, like, it was, it was a great moment. That was a real good little wholesome heartfelt yeah right as y'all see it's the next day i'm getting ready zay has a valentine surprise it's the 13th um what you said they double they booked the room i so, kind of booked it for the 14th but they end up double booking and i decided to just do it today so that's what i'm getting ready for it's at three yeah. what time did i wake up i woke up still feeling sick yeah, yeah. Okay, I made it right. they went to give me water gatorade apple juice i will apple juice so i've just been trying to hydrate myself really force myself to get up but as right now i, I don't even want to look at a shot we down there drank that whole bottle by ourselves that's a lot i mean we were on the boat for four hours i'm going back on mocktails what's that TikTok? i'm tired of this i'm too damn bad keep pushing I'm tired of this, Grandpa. Oh, that's too little bad. <laughs> you keep digging, I think. <laughs> yeah. Zay, he just, what you said, where's saying cute chill? I don't mm -hmm. know what's cute chill for you, but I got uh, that skirt outfit y'all seen. This skirt, like a little mesh top, my Ricks. I think that's cute chill for me. The thing you've got booked is at three. So we're supposed to be leaving the hotel at two. Yeah, it's currently it's 40 one something. Away. Yeah, it's 40 minutes away. So I'm pretty much done. I'm about to just do the last few touches and then I will show y'all my fit. I just had a kind of update y'all that y'all girl that went out real, I'll be back. real sad. Miami one. Nah, nah. Zero. All right, y'all, so I'm dressed. Claudia actually did this fit. I was supposed to wear it for Christmas. I was supposed to get a green wig and all, but they ain't go through, so I'm wearing it. Neil still looks cute with the blonde. Shirt, 1X blue. Skirt, I think it's like WN is wear. The Rick's Karen got me for my birthday. They so hard. The first time he got me for Christmas. Skirt is a little mini. And then I'm pairing it with my Chanel shades. It's like that perfect little shade as the skirt. So, yeah. Yesterday I didn't get to give Zay his gift and I didn't have time to get a damn gift bag. So I just packed it in my suitcase, like without the box and all of that. So I'm about to actually have him open his gift cause we get to do that yesterday. It's just in the damn bag. If you know this bag, then you know. And I always like to get a fly stuff. Fly stuff. So I can match my fly. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Ooh. Part of the Rick family now. That's crazy. Y'all always say Rick Pritchard. Now I'm finally in it. All right. <laughs> I brought my black ones too. Maybe we could twin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't want you I, like? I look for Rick's. All right. Try them all. Oh, you about to wear them? Yeah, I'm about to wear them. They so clean. My black one's dirty now. These so hard. Shout out to Karen. The fur. These give Grinch, y'all. That's why I was supposed to wear them for Chroma. All right, you got a model for us with your new shoes. Something, All something right. Simple, real quick. I get dressed for real later on. With yeah, because you didn't like, get to take no birthday pictures yeah, yesterday. I no birthday pictures. <laughs> they look nice, though. So, yep, we're dressed. And we're about to head out. I don't know what. Cause I got plans, so 
once I figure it out, y'all figure it out as well. So let's go. So we got dropped off and it says da Dania Beach. Is it Dania or Dania Beach? So we at the beach. Thank you. Uh, my shoes. We at the beach. Dania Beach. So it's on with the beach. We on a damn beach with Ricks, bro. Yeah, you've been on real on nude lately, so that's why I got got nude. This is so cute. All with the pompous. Mm-hmm. Look like home. Oh my god. Oh, look at the big jingle. This is so cute. Nice water. Look what's in the middle. Charcuterie. So cute. Happy early Valentine's Day. Thank you. Wow, I'm upset. <laughs> you did good, man. You did good. Thank you. As y'all seen, they surprised me with a picnic on the beach. This is so cute. I love the nude aesthetics. So cute. You definitely should have told me bathing suit or dress or sandals or something. I'm definitely not. My... But look at this. So cute. Come with a charcuterie board, wine, so cute. Thank you, sir. So we're probably about to, you know, get comfy and enjoy this picnic. We got some Jersey mites. I'm hungry. I'm about to eat real quick. All right, y'all, we got a charcuterie board. We got a speaker now. Up. Happy early Valentine's. That's strong. She's scared of the strong. <laughs> I'm scared to drink today. <laughs> but why? That's I why. never got messed up off no wine. That's why I never. I didn't even like say like, should we bring the Hennessy bottle? I knew you definitely didn't want to do that. I honestly told them champagne, but I just didn't want to keep complaining. Like, so they forgot your roses. They forgot your champagne. Yeah. But I ain't just gonna be like the Debbie Downer. Keep being like they ain't do everything right. We're probably about to play Jenga, sip our wine. I had half of my jersey mic up. My tennis, my other half. I had a little bit of the board, but that's kind of a big war for just us. All right, y'all about to play Jenga. We just moved it a little closer to the shade. Sorry, I ruined the uh, outfit occasion thing. You I said tried. he felt like I would have known if he told me what to wear. Maybe I. Uh, go ahead, so you can check it. It's hot. I think my nail stuff don't work for this. Yeah, this is real. Be cheating with the swallows. Take it out. I thought once you take it out, you gotta take it out. Yeah, was this one? I just made that roll up. Nah, you ain't make that up. That is low key. Nah, cause if I'm taking it out, they feel like it's gonna pop it back in. It's about to fall. Uh -oh. And the sand make it like an unbalanced at the bottom, so you gotta be careful. It's nothing for me, Zay. Come on, na 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 na. <laughs> it's getting real. Wind blowing. Right, uh -oh. it don't count. The wind gonna knock it down. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's risky now. It is risky. <laughs> faster, faster, faster. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting real. 
Ha 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 <laughs> it's over for. You say that every time and then find the secret one. Ah! <laughs> Look who got a jug. I'll jug with you though. Wait you ain't loose. Cheers, Cheers to, to Nana. Losing. Round two. This lawless fallless, the tallest lawless, the tallest bond in the bond in the wall. Let's get cut down. Zay Weezy. Who you think gonna win this song? You. Look at the RV. Yeah, that's 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 Zay actually went to college down here. And why you leave? I left because it was a hurricane coming. <laughs> I booked the next flight. The next trip that it was there, that they said that they had spirit flight, I was out. <laughs> <laughs> I was not about to play. We ordered some snacks. Zay about to go get them. I want to do like living in Miami for like two weeks. Let me know if y'all want me to do that. Y'all know we come on vacation, so we try to like, you know, have the most fun, you know, go club and do that. But when I come for the two weeks, I want to do like regular day to day stuff. Like, Go grocery shopping, cooking, chilling at the house, watching like you know regular day to day stuff, like living in Miami, not the vacation life. If that makes sense, let me know if y'all want me to do that. Not really like just straight turning up, like chill stuff, going to the gym. Um, what else? Like yeah, just cooking, staying in. Let me know if y'all want to do that with me, living in Miami for two weeks. But yeah, y'all know Miami, our favorite spot. I would live out here if it wasn't bad weather. I don't know, that's why I'm gonna try the two weeks, see how it goes, see if like it's somewhere I actually would wanna stay at. Doing regular day-to-day -day life stuff, not just, you know, vacation stuff. Let me know y'all wanna see that. Shout out to GoPuff. Snack haul. The huge one. It, it seemed like we're gonna be eating lays the whole trip. Pop tart. I was craving one. <laughs> Strawberry pop tart. Thank you. <laughs> we had to like spend a certain amount of money though. So that whole poppy. Yeah. It Gatorade for me. You I'm about to drink that poppy right, right now. now. Ooh, and it's, it's cold. cold. Yeah. Bro, look how tall it is. Zay, that's not, oh my god. I did it! I did it! It's so tall, you gotta stand up. There's no way for me to win. It's literally one, one, one. Let me see if I can help. One, one. Yeah, this ain't. That's what I was, the strategy that I was telling you. They're all tight. What you gonna do? Why Nikki ain't say North Carolina? Now we working as a team now because at this point we're really doing good. <laughs> you gotta come here. <laughs> For her tell is gonna get it. Oh the loser gotta run into the beach. Man, where we going to hell next time? <laughs> Jenga goat, man. Come on now. I honestly give up. <laughs> Down the real good jingles. Do that, bro. Do wait, it. Hold on, wait. That's right it. here. Wait, what, which one? <laughs> I want to try to do it without dropping it. Cause we down there can't do nothing else. Alright, let's see if I can get my chops. You about to suck. You got to do it so quick, Zay. <laughs> I'm about to hurt my hand trying to do it. I feel like you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even put no force into that. Nah, because I was scared. <laughs> You gotta run into the beach. I really have no time. Turn it down, this kid with the super freaky. Giving her a massage. Massage on the beach. Wow. Oh, this is so peaceful. Excuse me. Great.
break, please? Hey. <laughs> Thank you. What you want now? One, please. Okay, ma'am. Here you go, ma'am. Ten out of ten customer service. <laughs> I always try to get a massage every day. My back always hurts. I give you a massage every day. You sound like spa massage. All right, y'all. We about to head out. The picnic was booked for two hours, so we got like five minutes left. So about to head out, clean up, all that. It's so beautiful. I don't want to leave, but yeah picnic is done i really enjoyed myself this was beautiful so we are like 40 minutes away from our hotels what are we heading back to the hotel uh i probably need to retouch like my face and hair and stuff we'll see y'all once we get back to our hotel it's a 40 minute drive though so we'll see y'all when I see you, baby, sometimes I don't know what to do. I want the guys getting higher, I'm probably in the booth. I remember the time when you and I was out here skipping school. I remember the time you thought I lied, I really told the truth. Uh, I look at you. Stuck in your ways, you don't even know what to do. I let the way why you leave me and go and lose. I let the way why you leave me and go and lose. Uh, I look at you. It hurt me seeing my baby lost and confused. But it hurt you see the girl that you love with another dude. I've been down thinking about you, uh, and when you come around, I'll let you do it. Cause every time you come around, I'm in the mood. And you don't never let me down, you pull it through. To be honest, it ain't our time, that's the truth. But you the one I want, and you the one I need, and you the one I want, and yeah, you the one I need. But you the one I want, and you the one I Hey y'all, we back at the hotel. I put hairspray and put the band on my lace just to, in case, you know, the beach, it was hot. Um, and then I haven't taken Instagram pictures. So I'm probably gonna take little Instagram pictures in the hotel. And then Zay currently getting dressed. Well, you about to go to Zara, right? Yeah. To complete his fit for the uh, Rick Owens. So, yep. And I think I need to retouch my makeup. Like, I gotta look a little greasy. This view though, look at that, the sunset. Sun about to currently go down, and then they come clean your room and stuff. Our bed. This is the piece that you cannot buy. So yeah, but I was pretty much updating y'all that we made it back. It ended up being a 50 minute drive instead of a 40 minute. I definitely want to redo the picnic on the beach with like the right attire, you know, like a bikini. And it was so much fun, so I definitely want to redo that. So once I'm back put together. I will update y'all on what we doing next. All right, y'all, we came to Put Shack. Put Shack. Because we want to mini golf and get some drinks and stuff. Oh, yeah, they got elevator in here. <laughs> it's big in here, huh? Young adults. It's big in here. Yeah, we can start off with one game. And they got a whole bar and restaurant, right? His bar and restaurant? Yeah. So we about to get our drink first. This bar is pretty with the pink. Are we doing drinks or are we doing shots? Back dark tonight or you wanna if we're going dark then we need to do shots. If we if we not drinking Hennessy tonight, then we need to go. If we're gonna go to the club, then that means we're not gonna get mixed drinks, we're gonna get shots. Uh Hennessy so shot with coke. Yo, so we can't walk around with these damn shots to the rim, so we about to take them now. Cheers. Look at this drink. Just give it rainbow. We seen they had a drink that had Hennessy on it. Hold up. Hennessy Island. So we wanted to try it to see if we like it. 
good. It's good though. That's good. Can I just order another one? Yeah. Uno mas por favor. So this is the one we're gonna actually take to go play. One more. We we'll take one more. Yeah. All right, we got our drinks. So about to go play. Oh, you just had to click on our name. All right, we got both. You gonna have to get the. Hold on, I want green. They match my fit. Well, this not one though. Do y'all know where to start? This is the start part. We don't have a clue where to work. Start right here. They go first. Where's where you gotta make it to? Avoid the hole. All right here. Come on, you can get a hole in two. It's better than three. All in two, all in two. Alright, so look, I'm figuring out the objective is to get it inside that green Yeah, because that's going to make it right into it. Alright, come on. <laughs> yeah, I got to catch up. What's the score? Damn, I got to catch up. <laughs> Cheers to me winning. <laughs> what was that? I hope you got a negative 10. No? Did it count it? Let's see what you do. Wait, wait, wait. Don't hit it yet. Don't hit it until they get close to the 25. Like you got to time it. No confidence. That that ain't going to do it. <laughs> you got to hit it harder than that now. This one got... There's... Wait, wait, wait. When y'all playing drums up here? Yeah, we on that. <laughs> drums are <going. laughs> This one got drums. <laughs> you ain't hit it. Ah, uh, you are... <laughs> yeah, hit the super two. Super two. Oh, oh, oh! You almost hit it. You almost hit it. <laughs> You almost hit it! <laughs> Gee, now. Okay, okay, okay. Cheers. Cheers. We got this one and then one more. I ain't really record every single round for y'all, but Zay got 301, I got 229. So I'm not I'm not doing that bad. Hold on, what the oh Ooh, that almost went in. You need a hundred points to catch up, mama. You gotta hit it good this time. Why you hit it good? You hit it good. You hit it good, super tube, all in one. You did it. <laughs> you did it. You did it. And I got it on video. You did it. Plus 50. But 60 points. You caught up. You did it. You did it. God bless. Last round. Plus 60. I'm coming for you. <gasps> you got plus 50, though. Where the ball at, though? But you just gotta hit it hard. 381. The final stretch. Let's go, nah, nah, let's go. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. That ain't how you do it. That I don't even think that count. No, that, they only give you one shot, so that don't even count. You gotta hit it hard as you possibly can. What the hell? I really thought I was gonna get 60. <laughs> like, in your heart, you thought she was gonna get it? 319. You ain't that far behind. I only got 381. And the winner is winner, winner, Zay Primo. Well, I guess your birthday had to let you win. <laughs> Check out one. my foot. It's too dark right here. We gotta chug our drink because we're done. It looks so 
so pretty and what we in Brickle? Brickell, Brickle. Dang, let's move to Miami, Zay. It's on you. You like Miami? Yeah, you like, I always want to come here. I'm saying enough to live in. That's why I said we should do the two weeks living in Miami because we like it for vacation life, but we have to see what it is like, you know, day to day life. The only thing that's not cool is that is a they're natural disasters. Everything the hurricanes. Is like perfect. It's Look a great how pretty it is. It's February right now. We are here. So out. they never get winter? This is no, it get cold. Don't get me Cause wrong. Because you know I love my coat. Don't get me wrong. It get cold to where you can wear your coat. But that's like January, December. But it's never like real Too, cold yeah. where you gotta like bust a fur out. No, 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 no. They don't do fur. I don't know about that because I like my furs. I like my coats. But watch out. <laughs> Whenever I'm in Miami, all my problems go away. <laughs> they ain't got no music like this in Winston on the elevators. Oh, but I need to tell y'all, we about to go to our hotel, change. Well, I'ma change. You gonna keep us safe, my friend? Um, and try and try to see where we grabbing dinner at. I ordered a black dress because y'all know that's his favorite color. So once I change and put on my little dress and all that, I will, of course, show y'all. All right, y'all, this is the dress that I was gonna wear. I probably have to insert a picture so y'all can see a better look. It's a small, which I'm like, okay, no problem, because y'all know how to be in the gym. Y'all, yeah, this has no stretch, like, no stretch. It has a zipper and all, no stretch. It will not get past the booty. But it was so cute. It was like ruffles, flowers. I'm sad, I don't fit. Zay saying this look okay. <laughs> bro, what, bro? I feel like a damn lawyer. <laughs> so what I, else? Was, I didn't bring that many like dinner or like club outfits. Cause we about to go like dinner and then probably after try to go to like a little lounge or club type vibe. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? I look funny. <laughs> bro, just put your outfit on and you just that on. So why did you say I look good? You do look good. That's not the question. You talk about you look like a lawyer. Like, what? <laughs> I didn't see the collar. <laughs> just put this I don't know. I think I feel weird because this is not my style. Yeah, that's not. Just put this back on. Mama. But put you know back. when I actually did my sheen haul, a lot of people was complimenting this. It looks good. That's why I say all the lawyers talking about. So that's the only reason I brought it to Miami because a lot of y'all was like, "Yes, you look good in that outfit." Uh, what's what's the occasion for this outfit? Like that's like brunch. Yeah, something like more cute. Don't you mean more cute? Going somewhere that's like more professional. We going to like a strip club, basically. I don't know, yeah. I think I'm probably overthinking it because y'all know this not really my style. But a lot of y'all said this look good on me, so I'm like, let me bring it to Miami. <laughs> I don't want to wear my same outfit. I want to wear something different. <laughs> oh, I have this other dress, but I think this one gave it more like. Brunch too, like beach vibes. <laughs> I guess I gotta put my same outfit back on, y'all. Why you said put my outfit hat on? Because you don't want to wear this. You don't want to wear it. It's, it's okay. You don't want to wear it. You feel like you about to go get somebody out of jail. <laughs> no, that's how you feel. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you said, a lawyer. Zay laughing at my outfit, y'all. Bro, you said a lawyer. That's the only reason why I said it. I didn't even think a lawyer until you said it. I wanted to wear a dress. Alright, y'all. So I ended up putting this little jumpsuit. for like more a chill look. So this is just a black jumpsuit from the crib. Ricky's. And I ain't feel like switching my purse out. So we just going pink sling bag. When we get back home, I'm doing club shopping, dressing up shopping, like fancy shopping i'm a grown woman i need some of that type of stuff so yep this gonna do for the night you want to give them fit checks there you know you know me you know what i'm saying a little slight little fit check but i got ricky's on pants from zara you know hoodie from public image private club so make sure y'all go shop with public image you gonna say man something like don't something like it. public so, image got the got the diamonds everywhere Make sure y'all go shop with my peoples, man. So that's our little look for the night. I'm chilling. 
But, yeah, we're about to go grab food. We're going to La Playa because they have a lounge bar. Mm -hmm. I like listening to good music while I'm eating, so that's where we're going. Let's head out. See you once we get there. They got my boy to the office gentlemen's club how much did I know? Zay waiting for his friends though that's why we just sitting out here but we at the office Zay waiting on what, your college friend yeah and I ain't seen Cass in like four to six years you know what I'm saying my, my Bahamian homie from the Bahamas man he always showed love to me so I'm like let me call my bro when we get down here so we he was supposed to get here before us but our Uber driver was driving real fast in that Tesla he seemed like he wanted us to get out so it got cold out of nowhere. I done stole Zay hoodie. Yeah, we should be closing. Right? It got cold out of nowhere. But yeah, we waiting on Zay friend and then we should be going in. <laughs> Hey y'all, so it's four in the morning. We just made it to our room. It was a vibe, it was fun. That actually wasn't my first time in a strip club. I've been to a strip club before, but we just made it back 4 a.m. But yeah, like I said, it was a strip club, so I really couldn't vlog much in there. Y'all know it was a whole bunch, a whole bunch of grown stuff going on. But tomorrow is Valentine's. Um, I have a makeup appointment at two. Besides, like, you know, whatever's going on, I always like to get my makeup done on Valentine's. I just like to get cute, so. I wanted to get my makeup done because the outfit that I'm doing is, like, real cute and extra. So, I just wanted to look a little more cute than, you know, my natural stuff. It's at 2 p.m., so I don't know if I wake up, like, right for it since we is going to sleep a little later. Yep, for now. 
good night. Good morning. We up. And so they surprised me with some roses. I actually woke up at 9.30 in the morning. But I was just laying here. It's currently 12.30. What time you wake up? Like an hour ago? Yeah, I ain't wake him up. But I probably should have okay to go and got brunch or something. And say so ordered us some biscuits. But after this, I have to get myself ready for my makeup appointment. Pretty good. Yeah. Let's show them the roses. Let me try the roses. So basically, yesterday, what happened yesterday was all supposed to like be a part of today. Yeah. But they kind of like ruined it by making a double booking. So now it's like we got to find something to do during the daytime because the plan was to wake up, get your makeup done, go to the picnic, and then go to dinner. Yeah. But messed it up. And then they didn't bring the roses yesterday, too. So. I had to wake up this morning and I had to go personally get more roses and I had to personally deliver them. I walked about 12 minutes <laughs> to get these. They're pretty. There and back. Let me show them the little car. All right, this is the car we got. Happy Valentine's Day. Wishing you a day of love. I love you, mama. Thank you for all the motivation you give me day to day. I look forward to spending the rest of my life with you and one day make you my wife. <laughs> That's how my morning been going. Me and this biscuit right now. They talk about hot. I don't taste no hot to it, though. Yeah, I want the hot sausage. Hey, you want something to kind dry? Let me try. Oh, you dip it in there? Mm hmm. Let's try this little hot honey sauce they added. It's good with that sauce, eh? I'm about to eat that too. Like, way better. I probably wear some old skims today to my makeup appointment. I didn't get the new skims collection this year. She dropped like a cherry. It was cute, but I like, like, the one from last year where it was like hearts and stuff. Yeah, it's like syrup hot sauce, hot and hot sauce. Damn, I never heard of that. Yeah, that's fire. Somebody to keep going there. Yeah, I still got my mouth now. And then I would check my chat before I head out to makeup appointment. All right, y'all, I'm dressed for my makeup appointment. Told y'all I was gonna wear the um, Valentine skims from last year. Got my um, skim slot as well. I went over my hair, but I ain't really perfect then. And I just got these little clips. What else? Oh, it's 30 minutes away. When uh, we had looked it before we got to Miami, it said 20 minutes, but I guess since traffic is 30. So yeah, I'm ready to get my face beat because look at this. These new little friends popping up on my face. So, yep, that's how we're looking. So I'm about to head out. This is just somebody I found on Instagram, so I'm gonna try my best to record y'all. I'll be shy, but glam time. Okay. 
pray up and I'm waiting on a robbery. I'm the hype, nah, y'all ain't gotta hype me. I'm that bitch, give a fuck who don't like me. It's grand time, no fault. Pull out the truck and put the portion. These bitches high, they exhausted. Got bitches high, they exhausted. Pull out the truck and put the portion. These bitches high, they exhausted. Got bitches high, they exhausted. Got bitches high, they exhausted. Bitch, I'm ready from the trenches. Wear shots, I ain't talking about syringes. Yeah, I'm ready from the trenches. Pretty ass lips make these bitches cop syringes. Mwah. No balls. And I ain't gotta do a motherfucking thing. I ain't gotta do a motherfucking thing, bitch. All right, y'all seen I got my makeup done. We is at Super Blue, yeah, Super Blue. Rubel Museum. No, it's just Super Blue. Super Blue. Yeah, so what's the Rubel? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So we is at Super Blue, and I'm in my PJs. I hope I'm able to come in. You guys can go ahead. <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to wait. Well, I'll just hold it. Oh, they got the love Valentines. Everybody dressed up, and we looking like who did it and well. But we're just trying to go ahead and just get our day started. Exhibition begins. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> we can't have flash in here, y'all, so I don't know if y'all gonna be able to see much. on the floor though let's go to the next room look at this room y'all oh if you go under it match your heartbeat all right try one it said in each light bulb is a different heartbeat that's yours <laughs> We in the next room. We gotta put on shoe covers. Hold on, I can see this part of the there, but you couldn't see. It says somebody. Lord Delicate. It's a delicate space. My family was conservative right here for a little bit. So I don't think we're about to watch a movie about the church. James. Together inside to greet the light. And they downplay these. This is a room full of mirrors. Oh look, pose. Oh look. He's at the top too. Let's go up them stairs. It's making me dizzy. Oh look, you can see down, eh? Oh, it's basically like a mirror maze. Is it actually big or is the illusion? No, this is actually big. I don't know where people are actually. So we're in the clouds room. We gotta put ponchos on. And face covers and stuff. My head too big. You're gonna have to put your hair inside of that. I thought it was like a hoodie. Yeah, but ain't your hair going inside the hoodie? So we're done with Super Blue Museum. So now we're going to Rubel Museum. It's literally across the street. So let's see what this one is talking about. We got a little Rubel Museum stickers. Yeah, but it's not focusing. This is the first room. Y'all, this would have been perfect yesterday with our little um, streetwear fits. 
because we chilling today like this would have been some really cute instagram pictures definitely got to come back dressed up but i'm still taking some pictures for memories oh what's that that beer mm -hmm. what beer my dad <laughs> my dad need to come <gasps> my dad need to come in this room Kendrick yeah this is his favorite beer Look. like a room full of just budweiser's then we got nobody to take pictures of us for memories how they do this no struggle no progress i like that did that far that's that's oh that's how it is it kind of tells you right there like i guess who made it and like the little story behind it yeah and they get in a hangover at five <laughs> Like he didn't feel sick when he woke up. Cause mainly him and his friends, the ones that drank the bottle. But how you feeling at that fire? He been throwing up the whole last tour of the other museum. <laughs> it's probably so quiet, but we just enjoying the little arts and just, just looking. Oh, well, probably because we're not all dressed up. You know, usually when people come to museums, they like to capture little pictures and stuff. All right, y'all, Zay went to the bathroom, so I'm still exploring alone. This looks so cool and creepy at the same time. But that one right there with the flowers. Yeah, I feel like th I like this one because it's like more peaceful. It's not like really as crowded. But I would definitely come back and, you know, get cute pictures. But I like it. Hey y'all, so we came to talk in tacos just to grab something quick. This is the vibes in here. Oh, that's cute. Feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. This is the vibes. You basically order up there and then just seat yourself. All right, y'all, I got to order chata for me. You got me a orange chata. No, that's the, <laughs> I got Zaya mango juice. Let's try our chata. That's good. Sweet. Try your mango. Mango juice. That's refreshing. Alright, char tacos out. Look how cheesy that look. Look at all that cheese. Same thing, y'all know Zay just got no cheese. I'm about to go in. I'm about to get down and dirty. They got flavor, cheesy. By the way, the barbacoa taste, you could tell it's somebody back there know that what they doing. We got flavor. I need some, I need some uh, mama strand salsa. If I had a really spicy sauce, like that real sauce, it would have probably be 10. All right, y'all, so we're back in the hotel. And I'm pretty much starting on my hair just because I want to go ahead and, you know, get my pictures out the way. But we still got a little minute to dinner, but I take forever. But y'all yeah, know makeup done, I already know what I'm wearing, so it shouldn't take me all day. Oh, I didn't even tell, did I tell you that we had dinner reservations? I really don't even know, I'm talking like I told you. They did dinner reservations at Kiki on the River. I've been wanting to go to that restaurant for the longest. So we're going for Valentine's and I feel like it's perfect. The vibes is like hard, like love type vibes. So excited to finally be going to this restaurant. I've been wanting to try but yeah, that's the plans, y'all. Yeah. Dinner reservations. Um, our reservations is at eight, so that's why I say we still got a little minute till that. But I'm just gonna go ahead and get everything out the way as far as fixing hair, putting the outfit on, and taking pictures. Actually excited for the outfit because I feel like it's super girly, super cute. So, of course, when we done with hair and I put the outfit on, I will show y'all what it's looking like. 
I look like a Barbie doll. And y'all yeah, know the corset give you that snatch look, so. But I'm feeling myself already with just this, but we still got more to add to the fit. So we got these gloves. So I am gonna attempt to wear the heels to dinner, but I'm gonna have back go in case y'all. I can't survive with them. Long nails with gloves makes it hard. All right, gloves. It's given. Yeah, it's cute. I already the outfit, but like the accessories set it off even more. Snatched. Yeah, you did that. Uh, Clyde actually helped me with this outfit, so. Yeah, I did. Shout out to Clyde. Yeah. Um, I had got this in a large, so y'all know the girls. I hate wearing corsets. I always feel like it don't be like enough coverage, but I'm glad I went with a large and then just got the rest tailored, but the perfect coverage, not showing too much. Well, really nothing is showing. It's secure. Yeah, but. It gets better. Oh my god. I'm so obsessed with this look, y'all. A freaking bow rhinestone purse. And this is just from Amazon. I just literally looked up bow purse. And this one popped up. But we went with the rhinestone because the heels is literally the same. Little rhinestone. But then the heels is also the light pink. I am feeling myself. So, I'm about to add the little heels on. We got to try to go find a little picture spot, but y'all know I'll probably insert like a better video for y'all of the full fit with the heels on, all of that. So, yes, I'm so in love with it. Giving 10 out of 10 body snatch Barbie girly, I don't know, <laughs> obsessed. So, let's take my pictures. All right, y'all, so I'm dressed. So, outfit from Fashion Nova, Amazon. Dinners, I think, the hills. But I'm fully dressed, looking at this queen. Peter took me. Yeah, I'm all set with heels. Purse. So, I'm ready.
Okay, y'all, as y'all seen dinner, I was able to talk to y'all in there. It was like loud. I think y'all seen they were playing like the violin, but it was beautiful in there. It was a vibe. It just gave real romantic, all of that. I got the seafood pasta. It was pretty good. Um, my drink was pretty good. So, yeah. It was also packed in there. Guess everybody was trying to get in there for Valentine's Day. We can't drop the food off because we want to go, you know, keep the night going. First, we're going to go to some cocktail bar. It said they closed pretty late. And then, depending on what the vibes is there, if it's good, do we stay? But if not, is this other like little lounge spot also? So we got two little options. Probably gonna just take my phone, not my camera. Cause I feel like at the little nightlife or like clubs and stuff, I don't really like taking my camera. So I will see you once we get to our next destination. We had our first spot. Yeah, mama tried. This bar stay open till five in the morning, supposedly. It's the vibe. I like how you make drinks. Alright, y'all, I'm done. They almost done. As y'all see, we is going to the next this is location, baby, because this music about to make me go to sleep. Next, we're going to a lounge. Hopefully, they got good music. We made it to the next location. Mango Cafe. This is the vibe. Round two. we live in the lounge or whatever nightclub it was on south beach on the strip we ain't been on south beach the whole time that we down been here usually first thing we do is get the licking we ain't did that i probably ain't show y'all a lot in this little place we were just at because they was playing like some good music and then they'll play some bs we waiting on our uber it's 3 30 in the morning well uber is here So, what's the time on your phone? I think it's 3.30. 3.30? Yeah. 
Alright y'all, so we're back at the hotel and we're about to, you know, get into the night vibes. We're about to run above a bath. We got to run a bubble bath. We stopped at Walgreens to get bubble bath soap, but they ain't have none. They just had some. I don't know, they got some soap that we hoping it makes bubbles. We don't know. I got my robe, so we asked the hotel people to bring Zay robe and you know, hopefully we're about to take a little bubble bath chilling in the tub because it's so beautiful and we ain't used it so we like why not we got a handy bottle keep the vibes going and eh. i wish it was home i was at home at the hotel but yep that's the plan above bath this really nice tub with the amazing view oh my hero thank you your robe here sir so yeah, let's get into the night vibes. See if your soap works. Hello, it take a lot to fill it up. One shot, two hundred shots. Bye. And it's still running hot? I, I have it. I have it to where you like that. Hey you, it's the next day. We survived. We went to sleep late. I'm tired. What time we go to sleep? Like six in the morning? Late. But yeah, today is the day we leave, sadly. I just want to throw myself from the top of the bed. <laughs> Our flight is at 3, so y'all know check out be like at 12, so. Y'all, I'm tired. I still have makeup on from yesterday. I did try to fix my hair so I won't look too crazy. I didn't pack a going back home fit. I usually pack something, so we got this on again. We got like two more hours till we gotta head to the airport. A hotel is by the uh, what design district. Yeah, yeah I want to like walk around. Well, I have seen Lululemon. I want to go see what they got in there. I've been wanting to see Lululemon. And then it's this, it's not really a restaurant. It's this food spot I want to try. It's called Joe and the Juice. They got like a spi spicy tuna cotto. The girls had tried it in New York, Claudia and um, Tammy, but I was able to try it with them. Yeah, we got to walk around. See if I do some little shopping and then after try some Joe and the juice. We about to walk around and see if I buy anything. If Isaiah buy anything, you tell I. If Isaiah. All right, y'all. Zay don't want to try lobster roll. From who? Luke Lobster. Luke Lobster. He love him a lobster roll. Steaming. They look buttery. Mm -hmm. It's good. Holy. Like best one or just good? Like they want me to try it. It's a lot of lobster. Okay, no lie. It's good. It just tastes like lobster. No, it's not. I don't think I'm a big like lobster girl. So what you about to get you some Lululemon too? <laughs> All right, y'all next up. Now I want that set with the flare yoga leggings and the coat. Cause my other one tired of me. All right, y'all, we look at the room. Then I have like cute colors. They want me to get black so bad. I kind of wasn't gonna get nine. But y'all know this is her color. I guess a black won't hurt. I kind of forgot my size. I think I am a foreign leggings. But the jacket, I wasn't sure if six or four. 
I'm gonna try it on. All right, y'all, I'm glad I tried it on. The six is like loose, y'all see it? Cause this is supposed to hug the body. So I'm gonna go with a four, it's loose. It ain't snatching your girl up. Y'all probably can't see the picture. <laughs> but like, do y'all see how loose it is? The one I got at home is perfect, but Karen is also on vacation. So I can't have her check what's my size. So yeah, I'm gonna go with four. And then I know those are my leggings size. Bag secure. Oh, I thought it was some bug or something. It scared me. Bag secure. Thank you to Isaiah. What's that? My back hurt from carrying it I'm breaking your back. Oh, they got Zara. Let's go to Zara. <laughs> they got a big Zara. What's that? What's that? Let's go there. Let's go there. It's pretty. It's pretty. It's real big in here. It go all the way over there. But it's clean and organized. Oh, that set look like it's cute. This red set. Mm -hmm. It's cute. But I, but what? I wish it said something else besides Los Angeles. What's that? I like this little tank they got. I feel like I don't really have a lot of basics. And they basics feel like good material. Oh, that dress cute. That one? A blue one? No, this one. I got like a gold one like that. All right, y'all, just went with that little tank I showed y'all. Next, I wanna go to Chanel, but it's just full of like fragrance, perfumes, and all that. Y'all know that's my favorite um, perfume. So let's see if I find like a new one or something. <laughs> All right, y'all. Y'all seen? I got a new Chanel fragrance. They kind of really be on you when you walk in, so I ain't really show y'all me smelling them. But the new one I just got, baby, but it smell good. I think I got like. I think that's my fourth Chanel, it's my favorite. Definitely should have woke up earlier because I want to keep shopping, but y'all know we only had like about two, three hours. So I did my little shopping. But now we're about to go to Joe and, is it Joe and Juice or Joe and the Juice? So, yeah. I need a, a next time kind of Miami plan, like a whole shopping day. All right, y'all, we made it to Joe and the Juice. I already know what I'm getting. The spicy tuna cotta and I think a matcha. Alright y'all, so this is what it looks like in here. Cute. Ain't got no cheese though, Zay. Zay say he gonna try it.
If I take flicks with the guys, I gotta put emojis over like three faces, cause the fans can't see those eyes. People I shouldn't be beside. When I was an actor, they would go strapped for just to sell food on Bieber's side. Plenty reasons why I'm this way, my girl, that's just one reason why. I seen you around that Soto with Duff Man, baby, you love all some idiot guys. Obedient guys, jokers and comedian guys. You know I'm like six foot two and I write shoe love, but you love all some medium guys. I wanna keep you on a beach till 6 a.m. so you see sunrise. Seen you from the stage in the 100s, these must be eagle eyes. Pressing against me, think about entry, no, you could tell it's a decent size. You wanna know the real me, girl, so you wanna see deep inside. If Chumps has on a Chanel side bag, you don't wanna see him reach inside. Cause we know some demon guys with jealous and evil eyes. You know that's how Jesus died, you know that's how Julius Caesar died. I bet they were decent guys, I swear they remind me of me sometimes. I'm trying to be under your breast like peas and rice, you never get treated nice. Fool, you back. Missing Barbie. Back. But as y'all see, we is home. Benji, happy to see us. Y'all, we actually did not make it to our original flight. Oh yeah. We did. Cause I want to be shopping and trying damn Joe and Juice. We um, the traffic was bad, but they actually put us on the next flight, which was what? Damn, what's uh, that red right here? Like 15 minutes. It was like the same thing basically. So we're home. Right, I gotta see if Tammy wants me to get Barbie tonight or in the morning because Tammy was dog sitting and then my cousin Jay was dog sitting Benji. Yep, I clearly need to wipe this makeup off, freshen up and all of that. It's 8.24. I need to decide what we eating. We haven't ate all day, huh? No, Just besides that good. little tuna cotto that was in the, Yeah, we ain't ate, so. Back to reality. Back to our back heads. I don't know if I'll update y'all tonight. I was waiting on Zay to leave the room. He just left the room. So yeah, my mom is actually planning like a little surprise party for Zay tomorrow. This is all her idea. I didn't, I, you know, plan to do nothing at the house just cause we already celebrated it on a trip. But my mom is like real sweet. And I mean, Zay has been in my life for a lot of years and she just always likes to show her appreciation, show her love. And she really just always likes to have the family come together, cook some food, and yeah, she always likes to celebrate everybody, so she did tell me, you know, text me and say she wanted to do that, and you know, I was down, so she had told me to invite, you know, it's probably just gonna be something small, but she said she was gonna invite a few people, probably had Tammy come decorate, I think it's gonna be like, you know, something real small, but thoughtful. I'm down for, y'all know the party vibes, so we done turned up by ourselves, so. I wanted to update y'all on that. That should be tomorrow. I don't know if she's gonna need help with me grabbing anything. I don't know, but I wanted to fill y'all in. So that's what y'all should be expecting tomorrow. We're back. I need to unwind, figure out everything, figure out my life again. So yeah, if I got any new updates tonight, I will come update y'all. But if not, tomorrow, we got a little, you know, a little sun. Well, mama sure got a little sun on her sleeves, so. Just wanted to let y'all know what was going on. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. So today is the day I was telling y'all, you know, my mom, what she had planned. She said she was gonna have Tammy decorate, but she texted me last night saying that Tammy said Tazana wasn't feeling good and just been sick through the night and then woke up not feeling good, then missed school and all that stuff. So yeah, I basically gotta figure out decor. So I'm thinking probably just put some balloons in the ceiling with helium, his favorite color black. Probably try to get like, the little letter balloons that probably say birthday Zay. Something simple, y'all. So I hit up his friend, his name is Jave. He like shoots videos for him every now and then. I hit him up that if he could help me get Zay out the house. And he was like, yeah. So he hit Zay up, you know, saying he wanted to shoot a video. And the plan went through perfectly. I think Zay does not suspect nothing at all. Like zero, nothing at all. It's already in the afternoon. I finally got up. I didn't want to, you know, get uh, while Zay was here, I wanted to make it seem like I ain't had nothing to do. So he just left. It's already in the afternoon. But we're currently about to feed Barbie, y'all. She's on some new food. I don't know. She's just been acting weird with her old food. She was on a raw diet, which was Darwin's. It just seemed like she just lost all interest in it. Y'all, from the moment I got her, this dog was so in love with food. Empty every bowl. I'm like, I want to switch her food around. Maybe it's the food. Like, she's just not liking it no more. Yeah, I did my research, and we're trying out a new brand. It got delivered at Tammy's while I was on vacation, but she hasn't tried it. So, yep, I'm about to show y'all. So, we're about to feed Barbie, and then I'm going to get ready for the day. 
my cousin didn't ask me if I needed help with anything, so I'm like, girl, come come over. We let's figure out this decoration, what we gonna do. My cousin should be on the way, so by the time Duffy and Barbara and it get dressed so that we can head out to the store and get what we need to get. I went with the farmer's dog now this time. She was on Darwin's. It got delivered to Tammy. This is their sample size. So this is just to see if she likes it. You know, a little small little sample, I think for like two weeks to see how it goes. It gotta go in the freezer, so we did, you know, put that in the freezer last night. But some been out on thawing last night, so this is what it looks like. And what I like about it is it actually says Barbie's name on there. So it says Barbie's beef recipe. It tells you feed half a pack per day, keep in fridge. This one is the turkey. I don't know which one I want her to try today. They sent this container. It says the farmer's dog on it. So I believe this is to unthaw overnight, you know, put it in here, put it in the fridge, unthaw overnight. They sent her some little snap sticks, treats for dogs. God, and tell you how to do it, all of that. And then they sent like a little baggie. Barbie, you ready for some new food? We gonna use her Barbie bowl. I hope she likes this cause we just been struggling for a few weeks on her eating that she just doesn't seem to be obsessed with. So I hope she's just back obsessed with this, y'all. All right, y'all, this is what Barbie food looks like. It actually don't smell bad. Let's see. Sit. Leave it. Side eye. Yes. Do you like this, Barbie? So far, so good, y'all. I'm gonna let y'all know she eat all of it. But I guess we won't really know until like a week. Cause she can be eating it now, but I just want her to be excited about her meals again. She seems to be liking it right now, though. All right, y'all, so, so far, so good with Barbie food. She finished it all. But we gotta just see how the week or the two weeks go. So I'm about to, you know, freshen up. But I'm about to put something chill on. I don't know what I'm wearing later. Mm -hmm. But I'm about to wear this lounge set I've been wanting to wear from the brand called Lounge. It's the tank. I think y'all seen this in the haul before. I just ain't ever get to wear it. And they like some leggings that also say lounge. It's like a little chilly outside, but not really like the weather. Not too bad. I thought it was going to come back to really cold weather, but it's cold, but not that cold. So I might have to add a sweater. So let me freshen up. Let's see if I can do a cool transition. So y'all girl is dressed. Feel good on the body. So see y'all once I get to Party City. So see y'all there. Made it to Party City. Told them my cousin was coming to help. I look like they got a line. All right, Chess, so I'm gonna just go with this one because I feel like it's gonna be easier. And then of course his name is Zay. Yeah, you don't be expecting nothing extra now, we, <laughs> we just know how to damn blow it up. Oh, I think like black balloons is over here. Los colores. So I'm going with these 20 black balloons to put on the ceiling with helium. These the ones I'm gonna get blowed up. But we don't know if it's gonna all fit in the fit in the core. So I don't know. This is what we're gonna start off with and see how it goes. We got our balloons. Hey y'all, so we're back at the house. We basically about to, you know, let these out the bag and see how many more we need, but this was how much we was able to fit in the car. Are they just gonna stay or like do I tape them to the wall? Cause I know when you tape them, I mean to the ceiling, it looks nicer. Yeah. And then you can spread it out and you can for sure make them stay how you want them to. Alright, y'all. Stay on the couch here, girl. Let me put y'all. This don't even cover one fourth. <laughs> yeah, y'all. We don't need way more. So, the silver one, since it was like a little, just a, the second color, we didn't get as many. But the car we was in ain't that big. But we gonna get more. Yeah, just spread them out for now. Uh, um, I'm gonna cut the strings. We did it all together on the silver, but I'm about to have to cut the black ones. And then we're gonna move the couch probably against the wall just so they could be like a little open area. All right, y'all. So they're all blue. It. I wish these was the same size, but 
is gonna do. So now I'm about to just put the tape. So we're gonna put them to the wall. All right, y'all. So we about to tape it. We need to. <laughs> yeah, y'all see this the wall we use. But happy first, of course. Lie right here. Let me see. A little over. Try to cover that little mark right there. Lie right here. Yeah. So little. Right, they so little. <laughs> right here. Yeah, right there. Do it a little um to the left. Well, his name is only three letters. We gonna see. If we gotta move it. Right there. A little down, a little yeah, right there. Right there. Yep. All right, y'all, so that's what that's looking like. And we're gonna add more balloons on the ceiling. I think we're gonna add like 30 or 40 more balloons. So it should look a little more fuller. Since I already showed y'all going to get the balloons, I'ma just show y'all us coming back and add them. I'm not gonna show y'all the whole little run again. So that's what y'all should be seeing next. Us adding like 40 more balloons. Two more bags of balloons. All right, y'all. Definitely looking like something now. A little more fuller. So we don't know why the silver balloons, they stay like sideways. I don't know if y'all can see. So we've actually been taping them to the ceiling. They do that. Like, just lean sideways. So we've been taping them. But look at that. Looking fuller. All right, y'all. We moved the couch. Final. And mama straight up pulled up. Get thrice. Hey, She's making soap is just for Zay because that's his favorite um dish. But then she made mole for everybody else. She's here. She about to get, start prepping all her little food stuff. I'm about to try to put a little beat on, put contacts, and I don't know what I'm changing into. So we good on time. Sherilyn done helped me with everything. Big shout outs to her. So, yep, I'm basically about to get ready and try to make myself look a little decent. I'll show y'all once I'm dressed. Alright, so I just put on this little dress. I got a little makeup stains on it, so excuse the water. It's drying. I'll try to clean it off with water, but like I told y'all, chilling. Just a little black dress. And then I put a little makeup on, so. Shayla here. D here. My Aunt Mora here. Um, Claudia here. So... His friend already texted me like, hey, do I be on the way, you know? So I told him to be on the way. So he should be on the way. Whoever the few people that's here, that's the only people that's gonna get a surprise. Cause everybody is late. We stay 8.30 to 9. So I don't know what time it is. I'm not by my phone. We ready for Zay little mini surprise party. Everybody here. We're just waiting on the six though. He 10 minutes away, 10 minutes. And we've been pre game and we done took about three. And we got Zay shot ready right there. <laughs> Bro, don't tell me about trying to do a whole little. Mouth and I'll have it. She wants to do a whole smoke. Right. Nah, because Javier know what's going on. Jordy open. Surprise! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Look at me, <Benny> confused. <laughs> I got a shot. Y'all can't be doing it like that. I'm black I'm from the hood. Y'all be scaring me like that. What's up, y'all? <laughs> I gotta look at my reaction in slow. I definitely thought I was shot. <laughs> I gotta take a shot as soon as I walk in. Uh -huh. Happy birthday. Thank y'all. Oh my God. <laughs> I, I thought my birthday was over with. Y'all the best, man. No nervios, okay? Y'all ready to go? Happy birthday, bro. Thank y'all. Hosted by Mama Estrella. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday, bro. <laughs> I got blue. What's the theme? Blue? Blue? No. Blue, <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. What's going on here? What a hit, right? Good to see you. 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 Good to see
Look at Benji. I put these headphones down. I made me one so big. I made me two. I really want two, but I know the diet. These days so fresh. <laughs> oh, he done went and showered and now he got a my mama gave him this shirt. Cheers everybody. Fue la última que se estaba moviendo. ¡Montasia! ¿Quién era? ¿Quién era? Tía Julia. Ahora, verme. Ahora, tía. Y fondo, 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 fondo. Ahora sí. ¡Viste, yo te digo, Say 
Hey y'all, so last thing I seen was Zay's little get together. Like I told you I was gonna be chill, but I personally had too much fun. I was just dancing all night. And yeah, it was just a vibe. Big, big shout outs to Mama Australia. So yep, today we are pretty much about to clean this house because it look a damn mess. And I'm about to open some packages with y'all because y'all know I've been gone. I, it ain't that many. I got a few little packages to unbox with y'all. And then Zay actually also want me to open my Valentine gift. It got delivered while I was on vacation. We left the 11. It got delivered the 12. He said this is just one of the gifts that another one is also on the way. So I'm like... It's the Valentine's vlog, so I might as well show y'all what I got. I actually haven't opened it. Pretty much, yeah, today, y'all. Gonna say bye to y'all. We done had a long week. And it's time for me to get to editing so I can get this video out to y'all. So, I was just about to open some packages, show y'all my little Valentine gift. And, and it's time to get some editing in. Let me set y'all up so we can get into what new stuff we got. Alright, y'all. Let's get right into it. So... First two things is from Etsy. I've actually been real excited and waiting for these. It's like custom puff cups. Oh my god. Y'all look. Barbie's pup cup. Benji's pup cup. And it's literally them. I had to get both of them customized. I got these off Etsy. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed. But they basically had like all the dogs, y'all. Like literally all the dogs. And they didn't have Barbie's shade color. You know, she's blue and tan. They had all the different dachshunds, like different colorways. But they didn't have her damn colorway. So I had to personally hit them up like, y'all know, can I get a blue and tan dachshund? So hers is so cute. And then Benji's, they had the like blue Frenchie. But Benji is like a darker blue. So... I also had to get his customized, but y'all, am I extra or what? So, be expecting little pup cups. Next thing is also set for Barbie. So freaking cute, a new bow. Because Tammy had got me a pink um, slow feeder from Amazon, but y'all, it was huge. I'm pretty sure y'all seen it in her vlog, like huge. So she was like, she was gonna send it back and then for me to order her, like one her size. So y'all know I'm all for the custom. I went on Etsy. And it's the paw. The one time he gave me was also a paw, but this one I was able to add her name. I don't know. I just like the different bows. You know, switch it up every day. Pretty sure she's gonna get tired of the same bows, or maybe I'm just extra. But yes, I got that for Barbie. All right, y'all. So the stuff from Miami. I want to give y'all a closer look at it. The Zara tank feels like good quality. I like the little cuts right here on the side, and it was like this little black washed material it feels real thick i don't know i definitely need to get on zara and get more of their basics because i didn't really have time to just walk around and shop y'all know it was like on crunch time so i didn't i was able to get much but i heard they definitely got really good basics so i don't think y'all seen what chanel i got chanel is my fave fragrance i think this will be my fifth one and they just smell so good so we had to get a new one so it came with like a little sample so it came with two samples. <laughs> New Chanel. -y. I feel like their um, perfumes and stuff is more on the pricey side, but I feel like it's worth it, y'all. And like the ones I done had, I done had for damn long time, and they still damn near 
full or like close to like just not halfway like y'all they're worth it this one was 189 y'all look at that so cute i want to put some more in here smells so good so the lululemon i've just been telling that i wanted a new color but i like the bright colors but as y'all seen that i have so we had to go with black which he just kept telling me get black get black so i'm like okay i guess they said it's so good quality like i don't wear the hell out my other one um i don't wear it to the gym for errands like so convenient really good quality snatches you up definitely want way more colors bright colors but baby they stay sold out last but not least my valentine's gift and this cute little bag that says be mine i'm excited i love valentine's just like pink red it's just full of hearts it's just such a pretty holiday what we get i love this bag this bag right here I know it because I don't got them a few. This, this, when you see one of these, that means a vintage bag, baby. This is a vintage bag, y'all. Ah, I feel like a kid opening up Christmas gifts. <laughs> he actually got it. Y'all, y'all know I've been saying I want to go to Jamaica. So this is the Dior Rasta bag. And I'm like, I cannot go to Jamaica without getting this bag. Oh my god, y'all, look at that. The Dior Rasta bag. Getting closer and closer to my Jamaica trip. So now I just need like some Dior, Dior Rasta shades, like a shirt, some heels. I don't know. I just wanted to have this for when I go to Jamaica. And we got it, baby. It's getting closer and closer. Look at her. So pretty. And she's in good quality. Down there, look brand new. Material girl. Thank you, Isaiah. And then he said, there's another one on the way. So, this ain't even it. Y'all, but why did um a few of y'all was sending it to me? Why they saying it's not safe to travel to Jamaica right now? Like, let me know if y'all know more about that. Or, like, you know, I've seen some tweets about it. i seen some TikToks about it. And they basically just said, like, they announced that it's not safe to travel to Jamaica right now. Like, what? Now that I got my passport that is on the way and you know was one step closer to it like i don't know let me know what y'all think um i feel like when i go i want to go with a big group which i know it ain't really a lot of us but i do want to you know go with a big group but they just basically saying it's not safe and they say like if you do go get like a driver a arm driver at that so let me know y'all if y'all know more about what's really going on i just feel like on cloud nine right now i just feel real happy and you know 2024 has been going good and i just hope it keeps going even better but like i told y'all this is the end hopefully y'all enjoyed miami with us Zay birthday valentine's like as much as we did so thank y'all so so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and follow me on instagram because i just posted some fire pictures from miami so make sure y'all go show love on that I love y'all so, so much. Now it's time to get to editing so I can get this vlog out for y'all. And y'all know I'll see y'all in my next video. But comment down below where y'all want to see me travel to. Like, y'all, I just hate home. I don't want to be home. I'm trying to be outside 2024. So, yep, I will see y'all in my next video. Love y'all so, so much. Let's go. Got the kind of vibe you never let go. She know what to do to make a man go. Up and down, up and down, up and down Girl,